Uh, kind of a shame PlayStation is doing the same stuff all the time now and remaking things that don't need it. And here they are remaking Last of Us 2 from the ground up. Is, is that a PlayStation thing or is that a Naughty Dog thing? I feel like that's an important uh, distinction. What, me? Abysmal waste of time and resources. I don't necessarily agree with that take. That uh, remastering Last of Us 2 is uh, certainly a questionable decision. It's a Naughty Dog thing or a game industry thing. It's a PlayStation thing. They put it on their channel. Well, I. When you say they put it on their channel, what what does that mean? Because, like, it could just be a marketing thing that, you know, they they have it on the PlayStation channel or whatever. You know, it being on the PlayStation YouTube channel doesn't mean that PlayStation commissioned them to be like, hey, you should remaster this, this game. Oh, it's a trailer? Yeah, I, I think that's just a, a marketing thing. Uh, I don't think that's necessarily something you can attribute to uh, it's been commissioned by Sony slash PlayStation. Um... And I primarily believe that because Sounds is there in trouble. is there a Naughty Dog channel? Here they going with it is that um, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll get to it in a second save those smiles for your families the Tanakh understand only strength and ours was a poor display at best they will be back you the one who actually won this fight for us a word he has the same face as the second in command. I uh, want everyone fortifying the pass. Ah, uh, your warriors seem green as early spring. There are children playing with sticks. It's all I can do to keep them alive. It'll only get harder. 
So far, the rebels have sent mere scouts. But it won't be long till they return for an all-out assault. And if they bring machines with them, we'll need a lot more than eager hearts to win. You seem to know a lot about Tanakh's tactics. Back when the Tanakh clans pushed back the Karja Raiders, I joined the fight. The Tanakh taught you how to fight? More than that. They taught me how to work with metal. I'm probably the only Utoro who can. Never thought I'd be using what I learned then to fight against them now. We may speak freely here. Uh, did I do an hour two mark? It looks like I did. Okay. So, um, think about it this way. Okay. Um, let's say you have a, a YouTube channel and you have 50,000 subscribers on it. You can put an announcement trailer on there and you can reach your 50,000 uh, subscribers plus the reach of media outlets and things like that. Or you could put it on the PlayStation YouTube channel, which has, let's say, 600,000 YouTube subscribers. And now you're reaching tons more subscribers and the same or more media outlet attention for essentially just putting it on a different channel. And it has nothing to do with who initiated um, the, the project or anything like that. It's just, you know, how do we, how do we promote this as much as possible uh, without, um, with like the least amount of money or effort or you know however you're, you want to uh quantify uh the stuff that goes into it um and so for me when i hear that i just hear okay it's just a marketing thing um naughty dog could have totally just wanted a to do something different or a remaster or whatever. And they're like, hey, put it on the PlayStation channel. You know, we'll get more reach for it. And that's how I look at it. Uh, the curious thing is that the trailer is not there, which leads you to believe this is a PlayStation fully. You think PlayStation's channel is in the millions? Yes, you can see what I mean there. Still a waste of time to do that, regardless of who initiated it. Well... Uh, I, I think that's, that's in the eyes of the beholder. Um, probably have to see what they're doing with this remaster. You know, maybe it's like an expansion or something like that tied to it. You know, who knows? So, what's the plan? The plan was making new weapons for my so-called fighters. I sent my best climber, Voss, up the drum route to get the materials we need. Wide mods leave metal pods we use for crafting at its summit. But the derangement has made them as dangerous as the climb to reach them. Boss has yet to return. We have defenses to set up, and we are running out of time. If the savior of Meridian is willing to lend us her strength a little longer, I believe you can get us what we need. You know who I am. Red hair, bow, fights better than ten warriors put together. You're well known, and so is your little disagreement with the chorus. Can't Plainsong help? Plainsong has abandoned all settlements this far out. Then why not just leave? They're clearly outnumbered and under-equipped. You could leave. Head to safety. Have you ever seen a flower so small and white? When it falls, it looks like snow in spring. My daughter called them Winter Song. She carried their seeds to the day she drew her last breath. Now those seeds grow in the grove at the heart of River Hem, planted by my own hands, as do the ones of every brother and sister taken from us during the Red Raids. We, I, 
will not abandon them. I never understood this overwhelming attachment to uh, to the places that people live, uh, where it goes so far as to they would rather die than move somewhere else where it's you know peaceful or something like that. I I don't get it, but you know I'm a sucker fool, I guess. And uh, that lens flare is ripping out. What makes the path up to the drum root so dangerous? It's a cave of sunken passages and gaping caverns that only the very skilled can navigate. It serves as a safe haven for my people, but machines have patrolled its deepest passageways ever since the derangement. Even so, River Hem and the Grove live off its waters. We are connected to it as much as we are to the seeds growing behind you. Tell me more about these metal pots. They are tricky to collect. The Wide Maws sow them. One must be quick enough to gather them before the soil and water take them. But their metal is among the sturdiest I've ever weaved. Without them, our chances of survival are slim. I don't think I caught your name. Q. I am the metal weaver of River Hem. But all you really need to know about me is that I plan to keep my people alive. Thanks to you, we might actually have a chance at that. I'm sorry about your daughter. The raids took her from me. I found my peace in every carja that fell beneath my spear. Now all I have left of her is planted in the grove here. No Tanakh will force me out. Do all Utaru carry seeds with them? We are given our pouches soon after we're born. When we die, the seeds are buried. A reminder that our deaths bring new life. It is how we remain one with the rhythm of the world. That is a very cool custom. If I ever were to do a D&D campaign again, I might have to steal that. Oh, if there's no convincing you to leave, I guess we're making some weapons. You have my thanks. There's no time to waste. Follow me. This way. With those paws and a whole lot of luck, we just might get out of this alive. Let's hope these sprouts can hold their ground against a squad of machines. I can only cover so much ground and my joints aren't what they used to be. Look to me like they chose to stay here as much as you did. It'll be the fight of their lives, that's for sure. Almost there. This Let's is the see. best we can do to hide those who cannot fight. But if we fall, the Tanakh will find them sooner than later. I can take here. it from here. I'll get the pods your people need. Don't worry. Come see me at the forge when you're done. May your day be fruitful. Strange. Guess I better start finding my way up to the top. Holding up? I need to find a way up there. Uh, when I came up here, this was not what I had in mind. Definitely just throwing that out there.
me to climb up on that side. I think I'm getting anywhere through here. Can't scan this. Oh. There doesn't seem to be an easy way to climb in this cave. Uh, when... tunnels up here. There might be some underwater. Maybe they can lead me someplace with a path through these caves. When he was talking, I actually thought that. He was referring to those metal flowers. If I can't go up, maybe I need to go down. Take a seat pouch to cue. I think you will not be a taro. Suppose I provide cover for a while if I shoot that. That didn't work. Find a way up these caves. May you offer a gameplay reminder that would have helped with that loot box? Sure. Caster? Did that... Did that one... You know... I haven't... I haven't messed with... Anything pull caster related in... Some time. So, and... To be honest, I kind of forgot... That... You could pull caster chests, but it, from from my experience, it was only certain chests, and I definitely was not paying attention enough to that one to see if it was uh, pull castable. Okay, this this guy is definitely gonna give me the ability to collect those those flowers. One hundred percent. Oh that one that one's full castable. Okay, yeah. And do it from Uh, yeah, I <laughs> I forgot all about pull casting uh, treasure chests. Took you a while to remember you had had it and could use it. Yeah, that's. Driving in. 
It's uh, one of the many woes for me as well. I could climb up that, but why would I climb up that? It's a treasure chest that I've already got. I will also add that I think I've been very fortunate uh, not I haven't been in like a ton of situations where I need to pull cast or something uh, chest wise I've usually found a way to grab it without it which may also be something working against me in terms of mentality like, I, I just assumed, okay, you know, I gotta glide down to go get that. Uh, I can go that way. Or I can go this way. Wide moss. Yeah. Find some wide moss. No problem. There they are. Those pods they're rejecting. They must be the ones Q needs. Looks like I can just pick them up once they fall to the ground. If I'm quiet enough, I can get them without the machines ever knowing I'm here. There we go. That should do it. Better get back to Q with these. Oh, man. I, uh, I had already fought a wide mall. And I had already collected a bunch of pods once. And, uh... It's kinda silly that it took up until this moment in the quest Here I come. for it to be like oh you know you already have it but it's fine you know maybe maybe I should have checked for like a I should have checked for like a campfire or something up there oh well I can take it from here. I'll get the pods your people need. Don't worry. Don't 
Don't get mauled by the machines out there, visitor. I'm back at the cave entrance. I can make my way back to Riverhem from here. This is it. Do you have any questions? I'm ready. Good luck. Come see me at the forge when you're done. Okay. am I doing oh I got I got baited my oh I got giga baited I I had that quest it was active and then it went away and she was like oh yeah I got everything that I need And so I was like, oh, okay, I'm done. Oh, cow. Well, time to make that trek all the way back up there again. Because life is hard. For some reason, that treasure chest is back up there, which is very, very interesting. <sighs> That's disrespectful. That's disrespectful. All the monsters haven't, or the machines haven't respawned. Fuck <laughs> foo. That's the second sneeze I have failed to expel. I wonder what this guy would say if I murdered his uh, wide malls. I've doomed this village. again, shall we? Huh? Oh, 
am I going to call it? Machine strong against frost ammo. These. Oh, a wine mall now. Better get back to Q with these. See? She said that. But she doesn't actually mean it. What a jerk. What? Oh, it's like, what sees me? Children, did you come from? They could show me how to override you. I believe there is a system where you can hide in uh, stuff. I'm going to try that. No, yeah, I I have the pods. It says I have eleven pods. The game knew it. No disrespect. As well, floor up here a little bit. Stuff for the stash.
don't see me. Going down. I got what you needed. Not a moment too soon. Did you find Voss? I brought his seed pouch back. I pray it'll be the last I bury. But now I need to get the weapons ready. Let's hope it'll be enough. It'll have to be. Kill stealing suck. Guess these young ones knew how to aim after all. Even so, we owe you this victory, Huntress. It wasn't my strategy or craft that got us here, Q. I just brought in some parts. Even so, I want you to have this. It did good by my people. It'll do good by you. I'll take good care of it. Be safe out there. I don't want to sound uh, ungrateful, out there, but 
Gave me a green bow. Wow. What else is going on in this here village here? Huntress, the Tanakh would have raised Riverhim to the ground if it weren't for you. The first bloom of the winter song. I can feel the heaviness of my years fade away just by looking at them. They're beautiful. It was good to see the young ones fight for this place. I'll be damned if those sprouts didn't hold their own, strong as the roots of a proud tree. Just don't tell them I said that. Your secret's safe. Now, I better make sure our newly victorious warriors don't injure themselves while celebrating. In the hunt and in business. Ooh, y'all be selling stuff now. Why is that? Why does that have a heart? me let's see what this man's bow was all about um it's weak sauce <laughs> 76 at max I guess it, well, I'm not, I'm not technically using that bow. This is the bow I'm using. Okay. It actually does good damage. Does really good, uh, tear damage. All it does, though. Yeah. Look at my weapons here. Fire. So that's the only acid. I, I think I'll get rid of this. I, I, I'm not really a fan of that. Back circulator.
And an inventory. And then equip here. Higher bow goes there. Could be good. Hunter to hunter, let's trade. Okay. Apparently, I didn't loot everything in there. That's fine. Plain song, where's uh, Golding Spear? That is where I would like to go next. What quest was that? Activate quest. Ah, ah, I dig it. If I remember correctly, there are ravagers right here, so I need to be very careful. on fire. That's just something that's on fire. You only carry 10 arrow? Oh, this is a sharp shot bow. No wonder it sucks. That's what I get for not paying attention. Here I thought the weapon was good. Wasted all those resources on it too. Thankfully, it didn't require a crazy amount or anything like that, but. Still something. It was worth something. Shock could do a lot of damage. Sounds like there are people in trouble. That doesn't mean you can stop fighting them! We're not out of this yet. Take your target. Take your time. Fire discipline, Hatakto! With now we have a chance! Watch them! Hit that one, Kitaka! <gasps> Rise to the challenge! That's the last of the chargers. Let's find out what those Tanakh are doing here. Make sure I get my fat loot. Only they didn't mention the other machines that were standing right behind the rock. And I didn't order you to sprint into them with your eyes shut. Always suspect danger. Hey, who are you? Tell us who? what you're doing here. Who are you? Tuck -toe, you're what are you doing us? here? How did you end up in trouble with those chargers? You need to answer our questions. We don't answer yours. Hatakto, she just fought on our side. That doesn't mean she's an ally. That's pretty much exactly what that means. 
and we've enough to do chasing down these Regala zealots without picking fights with Nora warriors. Regala's desert Tanakh. We should be fighting alongside her instead of sitting this out. Regala has forgotten her duty and let her anger at the Karja draw us into. We will speak about this later. You fought with courage and honor. You're free to go on to the grove, Nora. If Regala's broken her duty, then why aren't we bringing her to justice? Because we follow orders. Do a manual save. Feel like I haven't done one of those in a hot minute. I just saved in a brand new slot, didn't I? Okay, no, I didn't. All right, one of the reasons I want to go to this town is because maybe they'll give me the ability to get this tall neck. Oh, also there's machine strike. And, you know, machine strike. Don't find green shine too often. This is just the woes of my... me playing open world games like this. You know, I just... Uh, I'm on the main story and then I'm like, oh... Let me just go distract myself by going to do this real quick. Then it's bye bye. Uh, main story quest? Hello, side quest and exploration. You wanted to speak to me? The name's Zoka. Have you heard from up north? From Bleeding Mark? I'm guessing that's a place. One of the desert's villages. They send their yield of ash blood so the Bereka over there can mark the skin of our soldiers. But it's been a long time since the last supply run. Too long. If you think something happened to them, can't you send someone to go check? Were it up to me. But with everyone fuming about our water rations, the commander can't spare any soldiers. You mentioned the village up north sends some supplies to the capital. Ash blood? It's a crimson stone that we grind into powder for our ink. Bleeding Mark has the largest supply. Our soldiers there gather and deliver it to us, in exchange for their water rations. Die for water. Everyone in the clan depends on the wound in the sand for their water. Capital and outlying village alike. But the last delivery of Ashblood was weeks ago. Our supply is running low. So must be their water. My face paint will strike fear in your enemies. Take a look. Check a look. If I'm out that way, I can look in on the village. Find out what's the delay. You have my thanks. Head north to a ruin where the desert meets the mountains. That's Bleeding Mark. Ask for Kentok or Natika there. They'll know what's going on. Good day. What you got, what you got, what you got? Uh... Medic medicine capacity, that's interesting. Ooh, very rare. Okay, hold up. Hmm. Let's see. I can take out the concentration one, I think. Um, it's probably not very interesting, all things considered. Dodge roll more times before stumbling. Hmm. 
one's uh, also not actually that exciting. This one's the most interesting of them all, though. I do like... don't necessarily like how it looks, but it's probably worth having. Even Hikaro has traded with me, you know? Unfortunately, I could not afford it. Why would the wound give less water? These rations barely get us through the day, Commander! Our children are thirsty! Exactly. I'll bet they're keeping the water for themselves. Yeah. Move, soldier. Move. Ah, the one. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Purge water hunter bow. Slicing hunter bow. Untouched. Probably better than my pyre. Maybe. Plasma. Uh, this is a hunter bow. Look how much tear damage that does. Ah, this blast sling? Yeah, we gonna need that. We gonna need that. Oh, that doesn't have frost, though. Never mind. Tide Ripper Circulator. Urge water. Yeah, that can go there. We'll take this one. Hearing Outlander. What else you got? Cannot be equipped on rope casters. Increases tear damage for impact and knockdown ammunition on sharp shot bows. I'm interested in that. Reload speed. That's kind of expensive. I wish the rarer ones were at the top, but whatever. Come, trade. Uh, let's upgrade this new bow. That heart, that heart has to be a job. That's what makes the most sense.
Who wants to play some strike? I do, but I need to mark first. 